guys, TLC here, and I'm back with another review. Today, I have this, which I have been wanting to try and get for a while now. So, I have managed to find myself another LEGO Dimensions set that I've wanted to kind of unbox and um, try out. I don't have the game still, but I really did want like the figure and the, the building stuff. So this is from Adventure Time, this is Marceline, the Vampire Queen, and I love her in Adventure Time. And of course, as some of you may know, Adventure Time has ended, so, um, sadly, which is a shame because it was a really good show. But the good thing is, I managed to find this at my local Smith's for four ninety nine in the sale. So that's really cool. Now, someone did suggest that I do some form of, like, speed build or something like that, which is why I wanted to try it out today. So, of course, we get Marceline, the Vampire Queen, and we also get her Lunatic Amp. That's cool. And, of course, with Lego Dimensions, that they can be transformed into three different builds. So there's the Lunatic Amp, there's the Shadow Scorpion, I really want to see that, and the Heavy Metal Monster, that looks sick. I love these three-in-one things. And then, of course, um, in the game, you can unlock the Adventure World and the Battle Arena, which I will shortly not be able to get. But I thought I'd open this up, so why not? Let's see here. Trying to be careful because I don't really want to damage the box because it's just beautiful. Please rip. Yeah. Um, yeah, scrap. I say I wanted to keep the box, but too late. <laughs> Open. There we go. Okay. We've got lots of bits in here. Definitely see a few of the base plates and a few bits in there. Let's open these up actually. That's cool. And then we have this little bag. Nice. So I am going to first of all speed build the lunatic amp and I shall get back to you. in all its glory so um i didn't realize that i didn't have the instructions for this and then i found it and then it just didn't cooperate but at least i have it and first let's have a look at marceline now she looks really cool i do love the figures that come with these they're just so unique i love it 
Um, you've got her boots with her jeans, her um, her vest top. Of course, she has her um, bass guitar, which is really cool. I love how they just include most of the printed pieces. It's so cute. So I love Marty's hair. That's awesome. She has a normal blank face, and then she just has this vampire, vampire, vamp there, vampire look. That is terrifying, but it shows off Marceline, which I really like. Now, she does have her exclusive printed base plate, which is really cool. I love just the guitar. I love it. So, here is the Lunatic Amp. This is mad. I love this. It's just got so many parts to it, like the big bass speakers spiderish legs and I think it's really cool that if you position it in a sort of way you can have it that Marceline is actually sitting on it that's cool and of course with the base plates you can scan them into the game and I think it's just really cool in general so I'm gonna take the lunatic amp apart and I'm going to build the next one which I believe is the Shadow Scorpion. That's going to be interesting. scorpion and I can definitely see why this is called that just because you can see in the posture that it does look like a scorpion that's really cool I, I love that attention to detail um, I love these little flamethrower things which I assume are like the pinches of the scorpion that's really cool I really do like them they were a pain to build though just because everything kept falling apart in my hands but it's really cool and then this axe is like the stinger. I like that. I really do. That's just a really cool build. So, of course, in my imagination as well, that Marceline can just sit on it like that as well. Just not as easily as the lunatic amp. But that's cool. So that's the second build. And finally, we're going to move on to the last one, which is the heavy metal monster.
have the Heavy Metal Monster. Now this one stands out the most to me. Just wow. He, it has so much detail. Just really cool. It has like a, a moving head. And it just looks like everything is his arms and legs. That's really cool. I love that. And I assume Marceline can just ride on its back. and That's so cool. So, there you have it. That is all three builds to go with Marceline the Vampire Queen for the LEGO Dimensions Fun Pack. I really hope you guys enjoyed this style of video. If you would like me to do more like this, leave me a comment below. And tell me which build was your favourite. Was it the Lunatic Amp, the Shadow Scorpion or the Heavy Metal Monster? I definitely know which one my favourite is. But I hope you guys enjoyed this video. Like, comment and subscribe for more. And I shall see you guys next time. Bye!